All right, guys, this is Mold and we are back with another Raid Shadow of the Legends free to play mystery shard only run video. Today, we are going to be trying to bang out this freaking stupid Iron Twins. Let's see if we can get in here and do this. We tried this on the last video that we had done. I think it was uh, either the live stream or our actual uh, progression video, but yeah. We're, we're going to try and actually win this crap now. We're not putting this on auto. That was a bad idea because now we got our speed up. We're going to try some different things here and see if we can get some speeds down and some defense down and some other stuff and see if that kind of helps us out a little bit. Uh, we have two heroes in here that can do speed down, which we just got. Nice. See, this fight is really, really hard. We're going to have a decreased defense on her also. So that gives us two chances, even though they just missed both. They might be useless at this point because our accuracy might be too low. But we're going to try it anyway and see if we can get a win on this. We do have Smite on two of our heroes, which is also very good. And we're going to hope for the best here on these speed downs because, unfortunately, oh, and there we go, Smites. Smites are what makes this fight a workable thing. Let's put it that way. Sometimes you just get lucky. I have a feeling having my pig boy in here is not going to be the good a good option. Uh, we are going to speed everyone up because we have the speed down. And now we're going to try using this to keep the speed down going. But unfortunately, it missed. And uh, we're going to use this. Let's see if it's enough to get a defense down. Even though it's, yep, nothing. Resisting everything. He doesn't like defense down. Uh, la, 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 we'll heal you. We're going to try a couple of different things and see which one sticks. We've been able to beat this on almost every other run. So not this specific fight, but the uh, ones in other affinities. So we're going to hope that that works. See, if we can keep, if we can get the speed down going, we'll be in luck. We've got the poisons. Uh, we'll heal her. Unfortunately, this stuff gets very difficult very quickly. All right, there we go. We're going to get hit. Uh, hopefully speed down. Nope, a miss. Always a miss. Uh, we'll just do poisons. Ah, oh, nice. Smites is what I want. All I want from this world is smite. All right, those two are dead. I have a feeling this is going to be a poor showing. I should have done a... Oh, we got the speed down, so it actually worked out. So we are going to revive her. You would think she'd be a little more functional in here, Miss Bloodfeather, but unfortunately she's not. She doesn't seem to have really good def uh, defense. And she also doesn't seem to have really good accuracy either. Should probably work on that. But this is also the highest tier, you know what I mean? We're on the highest rung. Things are going to start getting hard. Uh, we are going to keep poisoning. We're going to keep poisoning until our poison runs out. Until there is no more poison to give. I have a feeling Meat Boy is not a good option here. Uh, having defense down would have been nice, but unfortunately, it didn't happen. We're gonna, you know, we're gonna keep poisoning for right now because we're still early in the fight. So if he kills us, then that's our bad. Still resisted. All right, we got the speed down. We're gonna heal my girl. We're gonna revive Pig Boy. And then we are going to not shield. We're gonna use the defense up. And then hopefully we get a win here. I'm I'm trying to figure out the best options here. Oh, there we go. He's getting mad. All right, we are going to now do this because we're going to get hit with a big attack right now. I know we should have waited for the other one, but that's just kind of what we're look for we had to do. Sometimes you have to just kind of put that shield up. There we go. We got the speed down so we can start using some buffs and and hopefully we get something. Nope, nothing. He's weak. That's why he's blue. I keep forgetting that he's a blue dude. And we also, I forgot that we switched out the accuracy on... We usually have Mithrala in the lead, but right now we have Mr. Apothecary in the lead, which is not optimal, but you know what? It works sometimes. But they're going to miss, especially because he's the wrong affinity. Look at that. Everybody's almost... Almost everyone's dead. All right, we are going to use the shield to remove all that crap. And then hopefully we get another speed down. Nice, we did. Yeah, this is not a workable team that I would that I would choose. All right, so we've got our defense up. We've got more smites. All right, so now speed down is we gotta get the speed down going. It's like I can't even revive because it puts a it puts up a proc. 
And unfortunately, that speeds the boss up. So we're just going to hope that Sil stays alive. Nope. That was it. That was the end of all things. There's no way she's going to be able to manage this. Let's see. Put a shield up. If she had a, if she had like some kind of a regen, I think she would survive more. Boom, she's dead. <laughs> Let's edit the team here. All right, so we don't like Pig Boy. We don't like her. We want more speed down is what we want. So what we're going to do is we're going to bring my girl back in. And I think, honestly, maybe the attack down might be worth it. Let's just try it. Grush is really good for that kind of stuff, and he has a leech. We're going to hope that the speed down works really well on just my girl. Um, yeah, we're going to do this. Just He's going to get a turn quicker, but it's, it's okay. We're going to do attack down. Nope, missed it. We also have the heal on this team, so we'll see how it goes. We have many poisons. I should have put the lead on accuracy again, but unfortunately we forgot. All right, we got a smite, so that's something. Uh, we can't do the heal right this sec. Actually, I probably should have because he was going to get a turn regardless. Um, we want to heal someone, him. We are going to steal some of that buffage. All right, uh, we're going to keep going with the poisons. I'm going to hope for the best here and hope for a speed down. We did not get it. Uh, keep going. We're going to get hit with a hard hit now because we have defense down, so that's not good. Boom. Okay, we're good there. We got the turn. But is he going to get his little rocket shot? If he does, that's bad. Yep. And there goes a couple people. All right, we are going to not care. We're going to keep going with poisons. We are going to get a leech, hopefully. Nope. But that accuracy would have been nice. We're going to revive, even though it's a bad idea, but the turn is already there. All right, we got my boy. All right, we got our leech. Now we're going to use our shield because even though it's going to speed the boss up, it keeps us alive a little bit longer. Uh, heal Sill, since she is the golden child. Be nice if we had a significant speed down in this fight. Uh, usually we'll use your Carl for that, but unfortunately, all right, there we go. We got to attack down. That's something still no speed down. So we're just going to keep healing and hoping for the best. All right. Give me a smite, please. Nope. We got no smites, no smitage. Okay. Uh, we can't do speed up, but we can put the shield cause we're already going to get a turn. Boom. He's going to do all his nonsense. If we can get the speed down, it'd be perfect. All right, we got a smite, so that's something. I should have revived. All right, we got the speed down, though, so it doesn't matter. We're good. So now we can speed up and hope for the best. We're going to get some healing. Probably should have revived before we did that, but it's okay. We have smite, so we are going to get our defenses up and attack up. And then we're going to we're gonna save the heal. No, we're not. We're going to heal Grush because he's more important. Then we're going to revive my girl. She's going to have... The protection, so that's fine. Hopefully this doesn't kill Sill. All right, we're good there. Now we don't have our speed down right now, so there's that. All right, let's hope for the best. Yeah, all right, we got the best. We hoped and we got. Let's get attacked down. All right, we got crit damage down. We are going to heal her because I have a feeling, I feel like Sill might survive. Yep, she did. So that's good. That wasn't a, that wasn't a smart move, but it worked. All right. Let's get some poisons. All right, we're gonna put a shield up because we need not we need Sil to not die. That's very important. And then hopefully we can get some heals going. We don't have a smite, which is bad. Uh, we are going to speed up. All right. Got some poison, so we are going to use this to take some of that out. Uh, we're going to get some defense because we want that. Defense and attack up and a little bit of healing. And then there we go. Sill is back in action. Hopefully she gets the speed down, which she did. And she got the smite, which didn't go off, of course. 
Who needs smite in this day and age, right? We do need 10 poisons, though. That would be good. Lots of poisons is always good. As long as we have the speed down, we can continue. Which, unfortunately, now we don't. Please counter. She did not counter. I was really hoping... Anytime Syl gets a counter attack, it's a good day. Because usually, it, if it works out well, she'll have the thing. All right, so now we have... He's going to get a turn right now anyway. So we're going to use the shield and hope that no one dies. All right. That worked. My boy is literally on the edge of his seat. All right, we can't use any any buffs, so we have to only use things that are going to hurt him. Uh, please give me speed down. All right, we got an extra try. And we got it. Nice. Too bad she's going to use that crap anyway. We're going to hope that we have the shield now for Mithrala. That's kind of the hope. Oh, we don't. So we're going to use this. Get some defense. We're almost about to get that attack. I mean that healing, so that'll be nice. One, two, three, four. So like we're past we're past the easy part now. So basically whatever happens at this point is gonna be bad. No matter what we do, it'll be bad. Alright, we gotta speed down for three. So that's actually really good. We're gonna use the shield on my team because there's defense down. Now we don't have defense down. Keep the healing going. And then give him a smack in the face. He's gonna smack everyone. Luckily, we have the, the HP restore, so that's good. We don't have any poisons up there except for one, so we're just going to attack. Keep piling on poisons and hopefully get smite. And every time we get a speed down, it's a good day. Um, we're going to do speed up first. No, yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. We're going to do speed up because we still have some stuff going on. If someone dies, as long as it's not Apothecary. If she dies, it's not the end of the world. All right, we're going to use this to drop those poisons. And then we're going to get some defense up. Uh, we are going to heal Apothecary because we want him to stay alive more than anyone else. And then Popper. Luckily, I think we're at the end where there's not going to be a removal of the debuff. So that's a good thing. As long as she keeps getting that speed up while the speed is up, if that makes any sense, then we can win this. All right, so we are going to use, we're going to use the shield on the next turn because we're going to get another turn. Sometimes you got to think ahead of time and not just use the shield because you have debuffs. <laughs> Sometimes that's a bad thing. Um, we are going to heal someone. No, we're going to speed everyone up because we want to make sure we get a turn because we are getting the shield in about two seconds. Uh, hopefully this goes speed down. It did not give it to us. So we're going to get that shield. We have our defense. Hopefully no one dies, which no one did. We're down to the wire now. One poorly timed uh, speed up. Like if we get no speed down, sorry. If one poorly timed thing and we're done. So if we don't, we got a smite. So that's a good start. Please give me speed down. We got it. Nice. All right. Speed down. We're good. Hopefully. All right. Those two are dead. We're going to get Apothecary back up as quickly as possible. We're going to get the healing going. Uh, we're going to use this because we don't. We still get another turn, I believe. Uh, we're going to try and get his attack down, which we did. We're going to revive Apothecary because that'll be good. Now we'll get our shield up right here. So that'll give us defense, attack, and shield. So that was enough. Please smite. I'm about to say smite, do your job. All right. We're getting there. This one was messy, but it's it's working so far. We need Syl to stay alive. She's the one that keeps the whole thing trucking. A little smite might help this out. We're going to do some defense up. All right, we're good so far. Almost there. All right, we don't have speed up, so we don't want to. We want to be careful with what we do. Poison and smite, perfect. And boom, boom, there goes the robot. Look at that. We've got a win. All right. So, I mean, this is basically what we were trying to accomplish here. I know we can beat all, all of them. And we've done it on all the other ones, I believe. Uh, I think we're, yeah, I think we're done with every single state, every single Iron Twins, except for this one. So there are ways of beating this fight. It's just, it's going to suck. There's other options here. I mean, obviously you can use someone other than Grush, I've used Dark Kale. I've used a couple different ones. You could get another Shielder in here if you've got it. Like any combination really works. As you saw, Taya kind of 
kept dying. She's the first one, but I don't have her very defensive, so there's that. But if you're trying to get through the Iron Twins, I mean, this is a reasonable team, and they can get you through it. So don't sell yourself short on the heroes you have. Remember, anyone can work here. Uh, Dark Kale is one of the first ones you get if you don't have Taya, and Dark Kale works just as well as Taya in this situation for the for dying and not getting back up. But uh, otherwise, just try to get someone who can pl plot poisons. I mean, even technically speaking uh frozen banshee could take this place the only downside is she can't remove she has to wait for the turn to end that's the downside taya and dark uh dark kale they don't have to wait for the turn to end to pop the poisons off they can explode them and that's what makes them so good for this fight is that they can blow them up before this jerk off gets a turn all right so and that's kind of what you want all right so i mean if you guys have any questions things you want to talk about feel free to leave a comment i would like to hear from you guys and uh like share subscribe all right you help the channel grow we do a live stream every single week feel free to pop in anytime you want all right so this is stage 13 iron twins force affinity this is mobile gamer nerd and you guys take care